from 1999 to around 2009, a stint that he was able to win three Kenyan Premier League titles. Think about his international experience at the same time. Apart from coaching the national team, he had a stint in the APL that is in Rwanda. At the same time, he was able to coach young Africans in Tanzania. Younger fans, I know you will remember that. But at the same time, this is the fifth time he's going back to be the coach of the national team. Nick Mwenda is the man who's been able to give him that responsibility. And for him, he's saying, I believe in God. Mulay, I know what I'm expecting from him and I'm confident we will be able to qualify for AFCON and also spice it with also a qualification for the World Cup. Will this be a reality? Kwa mambo ya coach nilionaye leo ambaye ndi watatuelekeza kwenye World Cup na kwenye Cup of Nations. Tuliko tunatafta coach mkenya anao ujuzi wakushinda qualification ya kuenda mali tunataka. We are looking for a champion coach in Kenya. Na wakati tulipoangalia tukapata sio wengi. Ni yeye tu ndio aliyofunga Cape Verde pale tukakwenda Cup of Nations. Pia ni instructor wetu ameko instructor wetu miaka mingi kama unavyojua. Amewafunza hawa makocho wengi sana kazi eh, hata vijana unaona hapa amekuwa nao. Kwa hivyo tukaona kwamba hiyo ni kwanza. Lakini kwangu mimi pia tulikuwa tunahitaji ku inspire hii team yetu from where we were to another level na tulionelea kwamba anaweza kuifanya ndio maana tukamleta leo. But the first one is that we want to work hard to qualify for the first one. But even without that we talked about his clean slate is the World Cup qualifiers in June. He starts with Mali, Uganda and Rwanda. We want him to test himself, to take us to the next level. That to me is a higher priority than the first one. All right? But he has two Cup of Nations. It's up to him. His contract is until January, uh, is until March of 2022 first. So it's up to him. But if he plays the World Cup qualifiers, we renew. And that goes to 24. He has a chance to be the only coach in our time. Because... We will end this in 24, 25, and if he qualifies, then you can see what I'm talking about. Now, there is a lot that comes in mind when you have a national head coach for any country, but for Kenya, it seems we have been changing them with optimistic that they will be able to bring some positive results. Let me just take you through some of the coaches that we've been able to have in the national team for the recent almost 9, 10 years, and it is quite a number. Yes, for Ghost Mule, he's taking over from a man who a lot of people are saying is always there to serve the nation, and that is Francis Kimanzi. For Francis Kimanzi, he was in charge around 2019 to 20. 2020, we know his state actually ended in October, but he took the reins uh, that was uh, left by Sebastian Minye. Remember for Sebastian Minye, I remember interacted with him a lot of times in Egypt. For Sebastian Minye, it is a reign that uh, started in 2018 and went up to 2019. But before Sebastian Minye, we had one man, Paul Put. He never stayed that long because for Paul Put, he came in 2017, but in 2018, he was out. But there was a lot of talks about another tactician who was at the helm of the national team, and that is uh, Stanley Okumbi. For Stanley Okumbi, a lot of people wanted him out, but he at least stayed from 2016 to 2018. Before that, we had uh, Bobby Williamson. I know for Bobby Williamson, he had a very, very positive stint while coaching Gormahia, and he also had a very, very instrumental time in Uganda. But as a national team head coach, he stayed there from 2014 to 2016. But before him... We had a man who never missed some words. He had a lot and plenty to say, and that is Adel Amruche. For Adel Amruche, he was at the helm of the national team from 2013 to around 2014. But we also had a very, very cool, calm and collected man in charge of the national team in the period of 2012 to 2013, and that was the man James Nandua. Plenty of coaches, you will agree, but all of them, they had a different stint altogether and did what they could as the head coaches in the national